Let's start this video with an interesting fact. A chartered accountant and a CA intermediate or CA inter that is a person who has cleared his or her CA intermediate exams or are giving their CA finals. Both of these people are considered equal when it comes to the Canadian immigration process. That means they have the equal chance and opportunity for career and education in Canada. I know you would be surprised to know this because एक तरफ तो सी ए इंटर को बुक कीपर की तरह क्लासीफाई कर दिया जाता है और दूसरी तरफ सी ए इंटर वाले प्रोफेशनल या एस्पिरेंट्स ऑपरचुनिटीज मिस करते रहते हैं बिकॉज ऑफ लैक ऑफ प्रॉपर एडवाइस विद दिस वीडियो वी आर ट्राइंग टू सॉल्व दिस डबल वैमी फॉर सी ए इंटर एस्पिरेंट्स हेयर आर थ्री की इन साइट फॉर सी ए इंटर to help them plan their career education and immigration to canada insight 1 the work profile let's understand this insight with a real life example let's say mr a runs his own accounting firm in which he audits clients and signs their financial statements that means mr a is a proprietor in his firm now mr b who is a ca inter works as an audit assistant with mr a the only difference between mr a and mr b is the signing of financial statements they work on the same client and do the same work which is audit but in the end mr b supports mr a as an employee to work on the same client in the same profile just that mr b is not signing the financial statements and obviously because mr b is ca inter so he cannot anyway sign the financial statements now in this case mr a and mr b both are auditors and their work profile is like auditors and accountants so how can you classify mr b as a bookkeeper if you go and see their duties and responsibilities it's just same with just one difference but when you come to canada immigration process mr a and mr b are not looked differently they both are looked equal when it comes to the canadian immigration process and that is why mr b which is a ca inter cannot be classified as just a normal bookkeeper Insight two is about education credentials for the Canada immigration process. Now, coming to again a practical example of Mr. A and Mr. B. Now, Mr. A is a CA and a BCom, whereas Mr. B is a BCom and a CA inter. Now, when it comes to Mr. A, Mr. A has a BCom which is considered like a bachelor's degree in the Canadian immigration process. and mr a also has a chartered accountancy certificate which is basically certificate of membership which is also considered like a bachelor's degree in the canadian immigration process now mr a is holding two bachelor degrees and classified as a dual degree holder in the canadian immigration process now coming to mr b who is holding bcom and ca inter now bcom is considered like a bachelor's degree but the interesting fact here is that even the ca intermediate certificate is classified as a post graduate certificate in the canadian immigration process that means mr b holds a bachelor degree one bachelor degree and one post graduate certificate because ca inter is also a certificate right so when you see mr a and mr b Mr A holds two bachelor's degree whereas Mr B holds one bachelor degree and one post graduate certificate now Mr A and Mr B are both classified as dual degree holders in the Canadian immigration process that means they are equal when it comes to immigrating to Canada coming to the last insight insight 3 is about career in Canada now whether you are mr a or mr b cpa aapko in any case karni hai and when you talk about cpa it is about cpa canada because that is more recognized in the local labor market 
आपको अगर लॉन्ग टर्म करियर एस्पायर करना है कैनेडा में तो आपको सीपीए इन एनी केस अचीव करनी होगी नाउ कमिंग टू द एग्जाम्पल वेयर वी जस्ट एक्सटेंड दैट एग्जाम्पल अब इट लेट से मिस्टर ए इज सेट टू इमिग्रेट टू कैनेडा अब मिस्टर ए के पास दो ऑप्शन हैं सीपीए कैनेडा लेने के या तो मिस्टर ए कैन टेक सी ए इंडिया एंड सीपीए कैनेडा एम और ऑप्शन टू वुड बी टू डू इधर सीपीए यूएसए और ए सी सी ए इन इंडिया एंड विद द एम आर ए बिटवीन सीपीए यूएसए और ए सी सी ए विद सीपीए कैनेडा मिस्टर ए कैन बिकम सीपीए कैनेडा इन एनी केस बोथ ऑप्शन आर इक्वल ऑप्शन बट एज पर अस द मोस्ट एफिशियंट ऑप्शन इज ऑप्शन टू विच इज बेसिकली कंप्लीटिंग सीपीए यूएसए और ए सी सी ए इन इंडिया एंड बिकमिंग सीपीए कैनेडा थ्रू एन एम आर ए वाई बिकॉज एवरीथिंग कैन बी कंप्लीटेड इन इंडिया बिकॉज द ओनली डी मेरिट इन ऑप्शन वन विच इज द आई सी ए आई सी ए इंडिया एम ओ यू विद सी पी ए कैनेडा द डी मेरिट इज दैट यू हैव टू बी इन कैनेडा टू बिकम अ सी पी ए कैनेडा सो वी कंसिडर ऑप्शन टू टू बी द मोस्ट एफिशियंट ऑप्शन विच इज डूइंग सी पी ए यू एस ए और ए सी सी ए इन इंडिया एंड बिकमिंग सी पी ए कैनेडा विद द एम आर ए नाउ वी विल डेफिनेटली पुट अ वीडियो ऑन अ डिटेल एनालिसिस ऑफ वाई इट इज मोस्ट एफिशियंट बट फॉर नाउ कंसिडर दैट मिस्टर ए is taking option 2 that is doing cpa usa or acc in india and becoming cpa canada through the mra now when you come to mr b who is still appearing for his exams of ca final mr b can also take the same option 2 which is mr b can complete cpa usa or acc in india and through the mra can become cpa canada that means both mr a and mr b have equal career and education opportunities in canada i hope these three insights help ca inter people to plan their career well in advance and not lose global opportunities because of lack of good advice not just that chahe aap mr a ho chahe aap mr b कैनेडा आपको सेम करियर एजुकेशन एंड इमिग्रेशन अपॉर्चुनिटीज देता है इट ऑल बॉयज डाउन टू योर गोल्स एंड योर प्लानिंग दिस इज वेबो मेहंदी अ ग्लोबल चार्टर्ड अकाउंटेंट फ्रॉम ग्लोबिजॉन डॉट इन